2017, you know what I'm saying? Commercial break, peak commercial break, man. Peak game, you know what I'm saying? Got this merch. Link in the bio, y'all already know what the fuck going on. What the? <sighs> boy, how the hell outside, boy? What the fuck you got going on, nigga? Who the fuck you with, nigga? I'm swimming, I'm just saying. How the hell outside, shit? That's it. Can't wear your shirt, nigga. I ain't got no shirt. It's hot. Why y'all wearing a shirt? It's hot in here. You need some drip drip. Yeah, I need some drip. Nigga, we don't get you right, nigga. 17, we're up behind, nigga. Don't get you right. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, well, welcome to the next episode of Peep Game, y'all. We got our regular participants today. We got my boy Wap. Peep Game. Got my boy Ro. Yeah, we back, bro. <laughs> and special guest today, y'all. We got Jordan in the building. Hey, y'all. Sir. Hey, we just gonna, you know, do the regular thing. We're gonna go over the topics we discuss on the show sports, culture. Long overdue. Music. Yeah, long overdue, y'all. We fucking back. It's yeah, cool. Sorry for the yeah. delay. Sorry cool, for the wait, cool. but it's cool. So we're gonna introduce uh, Jordan because I'm. They, they don't understand yet. Jordan. They don't understand. <laughs> they, don't understand yet, Jordan. they don't know. You're starting to make Who it. is she? The first exactly. guest? What? Girl, don't so we just, wanna, <laughs> we just want you to let them know who you are and okay. what you do. Well, my name is Jordan. Um, like you said, I am an esthetician. I work in a med spa um, right off Roswell Road. Mm -hmm. It's like in Buckhead, Sandy Springs area. Mm -hmm. This was an opportunity I came up on. Um, honestly, I just feel like it was perfect timing. It was for me. And I never really saw myself in this space. But mm -hmm. I have, you know, seemed to kind of come into it beautifully. And I am appreciating and embracing the evolution of it all. Sure. And I can say that, like, right now, I am just trying to learn how to like navigate my career and like my personal life and then also still trying to like strive towards my dreams. So that's a little bit about me. Mm -hmm. You got to dumb down uh, esthetician because it's a lot of dumb niggas. Like, <laughs> like I'm just being for real. Like it's it a lot of like, niggas that don't know what point. esthetician that's so you got to dumb it down, you know, for the hood. That's yeah. valid. So I basically work with skin. So I'm not a doctor, right? Like I don't have the range to diagnose or prescribe any med medications or skin conditions for clients. But mm -hmm. I basically take what I see and I either do facials, chemical peels, microneedling, laser treatments based on what their concerns are and what I see to get them to what they want to see and when they look in the mirror. Right. Okay. Straight. Sure. Now y'all go, y'all go tap in. Y'all heard it. Y'all heard it. I don't know. Jordan, where can they find you? Where they want to know where they can find you at? Period. So Esthetician Bay is going to be my Instagram for my aesthetics career. And then if you wanted to book an appointment, you would just go to charettecosmetics.com. Charette. Charette. Y'all go get that, Jordan. Are you pimple face, bumpy face? Y'all you don't know what's Jordan. going on, twin. Just go. Like, yeah. Just tap, yeah, in. tap in. Don't That's check it do. out. Don't check it out. What game you got for these females out here? What? Oh, cool. oh, we just coming straight out of the gate. I got to just be 100. Like, <laughs> you know nah, it, it don't even have to be like, it just got to be game. Like, what do you see like in the female community that you don't, that you think you can help a correct? A yeah, message like, you would give to the, the females that look up to Jordan. Yeah. Oh, okay. I like that. Um, a message I would give to uh, the young women that may look up to Jordan would probably be um, to stay in your lane, be yourself. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> so, I and like I feel one. like it takes time to really get clear on your identity because we are always consumed with the identities of other people, whether that be on social media, whether that right. be in person, like with the people you work with or you know, whoever, who, whom you may live with, like you're just constantly faced with different personalities, different identities. And sometimes it's hard to kind of like, you know. Right. Yeah. Get clear on who you want to be, right? Mm -hmm. Like, and I just think. <laughs> just here, man, just I think it's I'm clear. I'm not laughing at you, gang. I'm just, you just funny. Like, I'm funny? Okay. Nah, you're that's cool, a fact though. though. She's speaking facts. Fact, it's a fact, yeah. I mean, it's, it's just hard to like, you know, mm -hmm. pinpoint who it is you want to be. So I just think, you know, be inspired, but obviously, 
at the core of you know, know yourself. Know yourself. Yeah, find Stand. yourself. Get to know who you're yeah, yeah, get to know who you are. Stand yeah, lane, find bro. yourself first and then know yourself once you find yourself. Yeah. Stick to that. Please. Stay consistent. Number facts, man. I'm pleading. Yeah. Please. Facts. So I'm gonna uh, go into the next subject we got here. And I just wanted to ask, did y'all have a good summer? It's kind of concluding, not yet, not fully, but mm, we in August now. I say out of the past four summers, it's part of the weekest. Yes, the weekest. Bro, like, I, oh, I had a great 24. summer. I'm See, not gonna lie. It's See, it's see everybody <laughs> have a different summer though. Yeah, nah, everybody did have a different summer. I it's, had a great summer. Okay. I see. Amazing summer. I see. What was why the highlight? Was, so y'all summer. Yeah, like why was it the weekest? Why was it the weekest time? I just feel like everybody got over. Like we just got out of the like the going out kit back or just yeah, being each other's face. Yeah. Everybody just doing their own thing, elevating right now. So, Niggas uh, really grinding for yeah, real. Yeah, everybody like, grinding for real, really. Everybody so, working. It's not everybody. really too much link up time. Yeah, it was as cool, it was. but like yeah. out of the recent cool. ones, nah, this ain't mm. hell. Nah. I don't know what was in the air this summer. This I feel like we had too much fun at a young age. So, <laughs> yeah, shit was we, yeah. Yeah. Was too much. we spoiled ourselves. Yeah, we like, was going crazy, bro. Like, yeah, like if you know, bro. you know, type shit. Like, you can't even hear <laughs> they explain it for real. But niggas was before yeah. they night before they time, but like niggas was tripping. Whoa, bro. we did a lot. We did a lot. <laughs> yeah, with a little, with, with nah, not too much. My, not everybody getting serious. I don't know. I say, I say this was like a six out of yeah, ten. Yeah, everybody me. locking six in. Six out of ten. Yeah. What you rate this? Six out of ten. I, this is six out of ten for me. This summer. Summer yeah. eight out of ten. Cause what's sixteen like a ten? Bro, that's like <laughs> peak. That's peak. That was peak. Twenty sixteen. Even oh, last sure. year I had a good 17 summer. Seventeen too. Like, this summer was that was what dry freshman fuck. year. Like and yeah. it went by fast. So like, I give it like a six to like a six or a five for real. Yeah. Like, I want to fucking it. very mid. Very <laughs> it mid. Cool. It was cool. It was a lot of working going on. I give yeah. it an eight. You give eight, it an eight. eight. I mean, she had it? a good summer. Yeah. Key, what you give? If I had to rate it out of ten, I'd probably give it like a, like a six. It's like because I feel like I learned a lot this summer. Like, yeah, like that part. I feel like I learned a lot. Let's yep. <laughs> okay, forward. learned a lot in regards to just like life, like like working, like conditioning myself to like handle all my responsibilities, line my ducks up in a row, and knock them out. And attack what I really want to do. Yeah. Yeah. I mm-hmm. feel that. Too. Facts. Yeah. Okay. Like, you gotta get on it. We getting mm-hmm. old, man. We getting old. What? Niggas is getting older. It's I ain't cool. gonna say we getting old. There's some old niggas watching this shit right now. Damn. Definitely some old heads. <laughs> We're not at y'all level. We getting old. But all right. So I wanna go into the next subject, and that will be the Olympics. The I've Olympics never... as a whole. There's a lot of controversy surrounding the Olympics <laughs> right now. A lot of controversy surrounding the Hey, y'all. The I got Olympics. something to tell y'all, y'all. Like, <laughs> niggas been wilding, y'all. Nah, they definitely <laughs> been wilding. This nigga right here <laughs> across no. this table, y'all. Fuck no. This nigga be <laughs> wilding, y'all. No. Yeah, y'all yeah, yeah, watch this shit and don't get it. This nigga be wilding, Fuck bro. no. It's a lot of context to a lot of shit. And the context <laughs> oh, to it, I'm going to get into it when we talk about it, bro. So the Olympics just passed. Um, it was a lot of controversy surrounding, of course, the sports aspect, the opening ceremony. It's a lot of stuff going on with that. Um, Which might the, I add, what? I've never felt more patriotic. <laughs> oh, this is the only man. time this is fucked with the United States. I have States. never felt more patriotic, but it takes I'm just four throwing years, that out there. Sure. So what was <laughs> y'all highlight? Though. What was y'all highlight of the Olympics? Like, what was the most memorable moment of the Olympics for y'all? All the black people winning. <laughs> black power. Back. We nah. can throw in everybody you know that's from the U.S., but like. All the niggas yeah. out there. Yeah. Niggas in Paris. Of people winning. Really went to Paris. Though. Niggas did pop out to Paris. Hey, man. Y'all seen over. the page, man. Them niggas went. That was my life for me. Them, that was like some of the best shit I ever seen. Nah, this, the intensity of the Olympics this year was like really it felt like all the time. It, like you felt it. You felt like I don't like know. It yeah. It's it's because 2021 was COVID, so they ain't had no yeah. crowd. I ain't even watch for real. Yeah, I ain't watch for real. I ain't even know it was in Tokyo. Facts. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody was paying attention. <laughs> they were on it. But no, nah, that was a decent, decent. That was like a. Curry got off. Curry got that last game. Oh, so Curry went crazy. Curry that motherfucker, bro. I'm sitting here watching this shit. It looked like 2K. I'm not gonna lie, the sliders was up. Nah, Y'all, this nigga Watt was going for Serbia. Because <laughs> Joker was on <laughs> Serbia. Y'all have down. to have context. I'm not letting nobody live that down. Okay, look, I won't forget favorite, that this nigga one went for Serbia. On the don't team, even know where so Serbia like... is. <laughs> but he plays in he plays in the States, though. Yeah, he plays in the NBA. Yeah. Right. But he, but he playing for Serbia. Serbia. Another so it was like, it was cool. No. It was just like a backup. I get it. Yeah, I get it. Shit. I, I get it. it. And sometimes I like to go for the underdogs. You know, I like to see niggas get upset. Like I like nah, to see USA fuck shit. Nah, USA gotta win that bit. I like to see fuck shit sometimes. Everybody but, was yeah. definitely USA. Out, I felt proud to be an American for sure. Like Jordan said, yes, very patriotic. Definitely. The scenery, you felt it. Like everything surrounding the Olympics, it just 
You felt that intensity. And right? then it just go to show, like, you know, despite all the little problems that we face every day, like, mm-hmm. it's like a stage that shows, like, why people come to America, why mm-hmm. people risk their life to, like, come here. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, and it's like, dang, like, we just be breeding this. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. we take I, it for granted. I, like, we look we back do at take like, it for granted. Some, some shit. Mm-hmm. Oh, God. Like, track. Like, definitely. It's like these people just be born like just ready to like go like you know what I'm saying it's yeah. like it's crazy but it's also like you know how much access we have to resources that help us you know mm. maintain a healthy body and, yeah so yeah. what for for somebody like me cuz I don't necessarily watch track was you was you watching keeping up with track uh here and there like, I was watching the stuff on Insta- like on like yeah. Twitter yeah. Oh, yeah. Trendy. Shit. yeah yeah, yeah. Trendy. Oh, okay, okay. Trendy I ain't never just like tune in tune in yeah nah, for sure but we won, right? Yeah. That's yeah. We, yeah. It's like hella racist, not, not though. Yeah, that's why it's hella racist. We see, yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah, it's like the four by yeah. 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 All kind of it's shit. Right. We, won, we won like a majority of them now. Right. For sure. I'm, I'm probably and then majority in gymnastics, is. I heard it was some controversy with the gymnast. Oh, yes. With um, her medal, Jordan Charles. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Medal. Like, yeah. Well, yeah. I'm getting revoked. Yeah. Basically, she and her team or her coaches violated a um a rule that basically states that you have to contest before like a certain time and they did it after and mm. in the moment the con- like her her contest basically her protest won and she mm. got the medal but they they're going back to, yeah. Damn, yeah they took, the they medal took it oh, yeah. <laughs> me if that's me bro you're not taking my medal <laughs> you got to come find yeah. me you're not taking my Wait, medal she had to turn like, the game you got to come find me exactly, like, send it back I in I ain't do nothing yeah. wrong they going to come and get you all later yeah. for the medal yes they going to make a noise they going to if they no, they're not. Send, they me, are. Send me to jail. Send me to jail over this medal. I dare over the medal yeah. twin. No, I'm just saying. That's a trophy. Come, right, come on now. Somebody gonna come get y'all ass. Somebody gonna knock you off. That's medal. bogus though. Jordan Childs, we got you. Somebody's That's bogus. Gonna send a hit. Yes. I'm not Don't rocking do that. with that. Sending her so even, much love. Going it's not even about black, white, USA, none of that. That's just That's wrong. That's bogus. Once she went home with that medal, it should have been that. Yeah, like imagine if that was your daughter, your sister. Yeah. That's fucked up though. Y'all fucked fucked up. Up. Other than that, we had a great Olympics. The experience was. Yeah, she still got a gold medal. Bro, a lot of, lot of shit. Like it's our last time seeing a lot of these. Great. When LeBron gone, Curry, KD Curry gone. Back. That's another discussion. They yeah. feel like after they leave, yeah, the bro. Europeans is gonna take over the Olympics. Yeah, man. No, nah, we still got people so? like Ant Man coming up. Like yeah. he gone. Come on. Man. I ain't okay. I still got faith in America. Jason bro. Tatum. Still do? But it's gonna be way Isn't class he pretty young? 28, it's 29. gonna be closer though. Kind of. Right? Yeah. Well, he like 20. He's gonna get like, they can lose. 26. Yeah, like, okay. I guess you. Can. They gonna need that. I just gonna, don't, it's, it's gonna show once everybody gone how much of an impact yeah. that them players they have. On, yeah. On the the league, the Olympics, the world. But as long as we have people like them, like they they gonna they gonna make sure the youth come up mm-hmm. how they supposed to. Yeah, because they definitely like. embracing the yeah. talent under them. Embrace. Absolutely. Yeah, they were playing out their body in that bit. Uh, for sure. So we're going to move into another subject and we're going to discuss uh, the music side of things, mm. music releases. What's tea? I don't know. We got to talk about this music, music man. Week man. is fuck lately. <laughs> <laughs> week is fuck. What's your outlook on the music? The past two, right three years, I don't know what's going That's on. That's your outlook. What's everybody's outlook on music? I feel like right music ain't been the same since 2020. 2020. Because niggas peak. was trying hard because they was locked in the studio. So they knew they had to make their best shit that year because everybody was gonna be in the crib mm-hmm. and listening. Like I feel like everybody that's the year was vibing everybody up. was really listening though. Cause like you ain't had no choice but to like go on trips, still, sit down. Like yeah. everybody was vibing, everybody working now. Like mm-hmm. it's kind of yeah. hard. Everybody trying to put stuff in motion, yeah. trying to make sure they don't get left behind. So it's kind of hard to like really, I guess. But what was the last the music? good yeah, year music of music? Straight. What's been the last good year in music? Is my point. What was the last like, album? Like a good though, year, not like a good like, album drop. I'm not gonna I lie, no caps drop. album. What was the last album that made like, y'all like, the ass, new bro. one? Who you say? Is talking about something. Who you say? Like we're gonna I'm give him. Mix, I'm here mix shit. About we're gonna cap give. Shit. Okay, well, you say, you I just no feel cap? like Mr. Crawford. No, I'm saying dragging I'm here, the we're hearing. Not even I'm just him singing. It's just like it sounds the same. I took a listen last night. I'm sound the same. Yes, it's like the same. All right, so look. When you press play, you already know what you're gonna begin into. That's what I'm saying. Like you already know what type of vibe. I'm so glad we're having this conversation. I was <laughs> underwhelmed by the album. I took a listen last night. It just felt like 
it wasn't a lot of effort. Like we seen Cap go his hardest, yeah, and make his greatest. He's too rich and now, I feel bro. like niggas, you know, when <laughs> maybe he just can't get that. In his maybe head, that was once nigga, in a lifetime. Things, I don't know. Nigga. But all right, well, I'm gonna just say I like got it. some albums I fuck with. But you. everybody, it's Since different. It's different. Most it's gonna be different for everybody because I feel like everybody going through something different in their life where mm-hmm. like certain stuff might resonate more than the next. I feel like he was more in his feelings on this one, and I don't know. I just feel like. It just kind of resonated with me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, I was in the barbershop earlier. Mom was playing this shit. Like, that's how I know, like, it's people playing it. I just, I get everybody outlook on shit because yeah. my outlook is way different. Like, way it just different. depends on what you in the mood for, too. But nice. it's nothing like that hood dictionary or man, that's that still, that human. still human. Still human. Still human. Is, still human is insane. Can we go back to that type of vibe? Like, still you human see, that's 2020. Like, still that's that human 2019, too. 2020 music. Give me like. a still human, too, and I'll be satisfied. I've been fucking with Rilo. I feel like y'all got it. Oh, yeah, Rilo. I got Rilo. Rilo I don't Cap. like y'all that last Rilo album, Barry. Rilo cool, though. Rilo Rilo human Rilo form. Like, As of late, Rilo been getting off. I like the first album, Barry. He don't even got to drop that much, and he's still like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I can agree. V's been tripping, though. V's not. Nah, V's been tripping. We got to talk yeah. about who been He's tripping. He's like the most more like, all these consistent niggas. right now. Oh, and since we have a lady at the table, let's go ahead and throw Lotto oh, yeah, out yeah, there. That's yeah, what I was I just going to get into. I was just going to get into. The ladies, yeah. the my girls. Fault. Ladies, my fault. The girls ladies, have been my tripping. Fault. My fault. She fast. Yeah, she's who, hard. I was going to ask, who is y'all big three in the female hip hop game right now? Y'all, I'm, I can't I speak for everybody, but. I'm going off looks, so shit. We're going off looks. This man I'm going Lotto. Nah, I'm just <laughs> but for real though, I really don't know. I mean, I can say Lotto. Um, I'm gonna go Lotto. I don't listen to Cardi B. Cardi B on, on some freaked out shit. I don't like, know who that is. Who is that? Mona yeah, who Mona is Leo. that? I heard the Never name. Heard that. Get off the dime, Julio. Oh, that's her. <laughs> <laughs> but no, she got this no, one song. Her. But let me tell you, it's about they. It's about their demeanor. Like she got yeah. that demeanor about herself, where it's just like nigga, like yeah. yeah. But it's still like she could. She could still. It's, it's, it's like. Both she could do both, like she could do the soft, cute mm-hmm. girl shit, but then it's like on some like. Um, see, I see for females, around, it's you know? different. You know, they need both of that. They need like they can't just have like got to be versatile. Yeah, you can't just yeah, be fucking nigga. Exactly. Fuck, fuck, fuck. So you don't fuck with Ice Spice? No. Okay, cool. Is that uh, up north? <laughs> nah, I think no. I think like, no well, females fuck with Ice so Spice. Like, that is, is I'm not gonna her, like, That is a thing. Like it's it must be up north for some no shit. girls. It's commercial. I'm not gonna say no girls fuck with Ice Spice. Is she an industry? Player? But the the, <laughs> the women maybe it's because we're 22, 23. We're on the same age. Yeah. But like nobody really bumping Ice Spice. Not probably, here. At yeah. Least. Probably high maybe school. Maybe not here. This shit probably got to be in New York. On some real shit though. Before she blew up. Like I would see her like uh on the radar and mm-hmm, like type shit, yeah. like and I'm like okay shawty hard like I seen her on live because she was rapping yeah but when it got to like the music that was really going for her it was more on some like <laughs> one two three elementary to me yeah. one, two, three. and it just the that don't resonate wasn't there yeah it wasn't. <sighs> If That's why I don't throw Doja just like Cat in my top three. If you a fan, Doja come can rap. Like Doja Cat, Doja can rap. We not hard. even gonna play on Doja I mean, top. Even though she hard. just on some weird type time Doja that Cat, I can't all the way get with. <laughs> like <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Wait, what you was saying? Doja man. Nah, she just be on some too weird. She she got yeah. She be wild. She be wild. She got a lot of that type of female. I don't know if I could just like. Kick it with. I can kick it with, but she just be giving me. Well, too you be many. having bad dreams. Fucking yeah, kick it with Doja. Saying. Like Doja gonna have I you. Can't, I can't. Like what she it's like, like. If you there's promotes. like so many other choices. Doja. Exactly. <laughs> so you said there's so many on, identities on, 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 on. you can take on. Let's Not bring it her. back. Let's bring it back. You said Lotto. Who's second? I said Lotto. I'm going off. Looks. Second. Um, you said, yeah. Who's second? For female who's second? rap. Yeah. I'm let her go. Oh, you gonna go, Jordan? Say less. We gonna spin back to Jesse. We can. We can. We can. I say looks, gang. I'm going off looks because I don't. I'm gonna be 100. I don't really listen to the music like that. I do, but I don't like. I listen to it if I hear it on TikTok, like Anasia. Yeah. But Anasia. I ain't gonna front on females like they not five, bro. Like, I just don't listen to it. That's all. Anasia. Uh, no, I don't listen to all of it. That's all. Girl. Who y'all third? I, I think you had two, right? You said Mona Leo. I said Mona Leo too. Yeah, Mona Leo. Over sexy red. Sexy oh, Red I, I really give it had sexy her time, red. or you think her time up, or she's still going? She on nah, the she's run. Going. She's, she's still going. She's, she's on the run. She's, she's gonna be going. there for a she little second. She was just second. in the. I ain't gonna say all that. I saw that. You know, she was just making her feet. That is weird. She had the WWE belt. Some shit. Holding that bitch over her head. Oh god, she in the WWE. But I like Flo Millie too, though. Flo Millie. But she's straight. She's straight. She cool. Flo Millie like. She just she like the female Jacquees like she just remix your shit real quick. That's not true. 
Slit. Her music, know. Right. yeah, because I, I did. Bro, I heard her remix of Cardi, so I'm like, what the fuck? Cardi, how, did, how the fuck? Is she Babyface this? Ray. I was like, whoa. She had performed when Gunna came in town. Nah, but I fuck. Cool I, ain't, I ain't dissing her. Family cool she though. Got a couple shits. Yeah, it's definitely Lotto. She gets Mona spent. Leo. Lotto. So Lotto got the the crown. Hey, we, the we city saying Sexy she Ray got too. the hardest. Uh, the Sexy hardest Ray. Album. Ain't Nicki Minaj still in the combo? Cause she dropped like what? September last year. Would you still I, put her in that combo? Nikki's a vet. Like that's like that's a whole different conversation. But you still gotta add the vet. You can't just leave. That's like us saying top five and not or top ten. No, not I just gotta LeBron. say what resonate at the moment. Oh, what's right now? How, all right, yeah. Right now, right now. Context, okay. okay Putting context. Nikki in the top right now would be crazy. If I right, had to say the top barbs three, are crazy I don't know. like that, gang. Yeah, I'll man. put Lotto on one though. Lotto, like, like she, she, be, she she be having some shit. She got the pole pack, she got the look, she got the music, she yep. got the swag. <laughs> She yeah, got, I ain't even doing looks, but I'll say Glow Rillify really too. Glow? glow Big Glow? I forgot about Big Glow. She having glow. something, bro. Big Glow, definitely. She's been popping <laughs> off this year. 2024 shit. for sure. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. Just from me hearing shit, I be hearing her shit. Third. Mm, I don't know, bro. Like, it's really like a toss up of three. Like, I don't Ooh, know. Who would you pick? Probably Sexy Red, though. Sexy. Probably go Sexy Red and then Glow. Sexy Red had him Sexy turn. Cool. Had him, like she doing Sexy her job. Red, she on a run. She, she on a she crazy on a, run. Like, unbelievable for, run. She's been like, relevant for a minute. Like two yeah. years. Yeah, and it's always, it's not like it sound the same. She's not switching it up though. She's not switching it up, but it's not like it sound the same. Yeah. Like, I can't explain it. <clears throat> Shout out to Sexy agree. Red though. Sexy. All right, we're going to go into another topic. I think I got one. I think I got a topic I want to, not what? to cut you off in there. What happened? I think I, how do y'all feel about, let me see. <laughs> so I got these topics right here. I feel like we should just skim through these bitches. Hmm. Hmm. How do y'all feel about relationships in Atlanta? Relationships. I feel in like the everybody city. out for some shit, bro. <laughs> I yeah. feel like there's no genuine shit. Like, yeah. it's, it's, I'm not gonna say none, but I feel like it's a lot of not genuine shit going on, y'all. True. Like, if I just on the outside looking in type shit, or not even on the outside looking in, just. <laughs> Just being in it, bit like, yeah. I feel like that's the problem. What? Like niggas with that mindset. Mm. <laughs> nah, you can't. It's say not even that a mindset. Damn, <laughs> there's damn near like what the fuck. It's like, like what it's you a think preconceived it is. notion. You're going into dating thinking that everybody. Nah, is, I'm not. Or though. most women <laughs> or most people are out for something. Mm. You are. You just told me that's the first thing you said when he brought a relationship. So that's how you feel. But you gotta look at reality too, though. You Why have does to he look feel that reality. way? Exactly. And that's fine. That's <laughs> fine. Like, yeah. see, or like, what the I, right? Like, but I get both sides. Yes, I understand why you could feel that way. Yeah. But I just wouldn't like. I just wouldn't entertain that because I feel like you're giving other people a little too much power. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like. When you thinking like somebody out to get something, like okay, can you not detect when somebody's out to get something? Can you not detect a genuine person when you when you? Nah, I can detect it though. Yeah. Okay, then, so. I can detect it. Though. I can detect. <laughs> you know, you know when you get finesse. <laughs> you know when somebody trying to finesse like, you. Like, so I can wow. You know when somebody wants some. Like I'll give it a chance. I ain't gonna go into it on some, on the bullshit. I don't, you know what I'm saying? Like, see, the thing I is, I just think it like it's that. over such like it's like. Like they're abusing the power of Who's like they? we not even finna do this. They. We the shadow we're just people. gonna say they, okay? We're it's not the shadow gonna... people, but they, <laughs> they're just the you like abusing like the the like men having not even having just men being men, like men doing men shit. Like, you think it's immediate? Who was abusing it? I think I get what you're saying though. You like know they what try to OD like, on women's it's, shit. It's like, like certain shit, like know. certain dates or certain events, like, or it's just like a certain personality or a persona you gotta be pushing for you to even attract. A certain type of female, if you get what I'm saying, like for the sure, Instagram mm. or media alone yeah, is media. one for reason. Sure. That is one reason, and that's what's fucked fucked up the game to me. The okay. media. What you think? I have so many conclusions, and I do think that multiple things can be true at one time. Okay, but one thing I will say is like, okay, I've encountered guys who have that kind of mindset, right? Mm-hmm. And even if you're not trying to project that in ways it comes out, right? And so when somebody can sense that like you are even on eggshells about somebody potentially being transactional with you, because that's essentially what yeah. it is, right? Like now it's like a you put them in you put them now in a in a bubble or a box to where like either they can fully show that or they could act and mask <laughs> what it is, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, to still want. get what they want out mm-hmm. of you. Cause it's 
That's how it goes. But that's manipulating, bro. Right, females but that's, are but manipulators. It's, no, okay, it's not just females not or just women. Female. Let's All just, of us are manipulators, women and men. but women abuse. That's why I say it's abuse. It's, it's being abused. It's Because I feel like, well, I'm not going to even say like just social media, but social media do play a lot of role because we got a lot of influencers Too that's much. like really just... <clears throat> Mm-hmm. And it's not even like they're saying the wrong message. I think they're just putting the message out, but they're abusing it. Like I'm saying, like, yeah, make sure this nigga not just fucking you and make sure he actually love you or taking care of you, shit like that. But right. you want the extra Dexter, like the top shelf shit, or just want you like, I don't know. Yeah, it, it, you gotta grow. You gotta be like I feel like you gotta be genuine. Personally. You can't just like force it on a nigga to do this for you, do that, do that. You gotta know your but worth. Like, yeah. If you're not worth <laughs> If you know you can't, you can't go in the store and buy a Bugatti with, without the Bugatti money or the Bugatti, the shit that comes with purchasing the Bugatti. So you can't approach the dating scene like that. Like okay, like you, you were saying, know your worth. Basically, man. being what you're ex- what you're expecting out of somebody. Not know your exactly. worth, know yourself. Literally, that yourself. you gotta yeah. know what you bring to the table in order to get what you want. Facts. Yeah, but I think I think there's something like that. Nobody is also factoring into the equation. Even with that mindset, it's like. Nobody's perfect. Nobody's mm, finna sit here and just be like, cool. like you know what I'm saying? Like a girl, a like okay, okay, want. Roman. <laughs> yeah. Like I might ask you for this. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like on some just okay. I'm not thinking that you're thinking I'm a transactional person by asking. Like yeah. but that's a conversation me and you could have. Yeah, okay. Right. And, okay. It, and it not Certain be like shit, yeah. oh, that's she, why I say it's levels. You know though. what you I'm saying? Gotta, like you can't just you got to build. Not even say you got to take long be, for you to. It's just yeah, you gotta be like, <laughs> off the rip, like how we was dating in high school. You wasn't asking for all this shit at the beginning of high school. Like <laughs> yeah. you got to know each other first, at least. And then, like, uh, yeah, like because you might not uh, even fuck with this person for real. But like, it, but okay, in that same instance, it's like y'all can say that about women, but like a lot of times y'all go into a lot of situations might expect sex on yeah. the first okay. go See, round. I mean, like, it's both ways whatever. to a lot of shit. It, it's it's definitely a double standard. So it's like at the end of the day. See, Both people, men and women, have to be able to communicate their boundaries yeah. with no judgment. Right. Like, so look, okay, if you expecting like us to just fuck just because it's a vibe, like, then I'm gonna just tell you, like, I'm not gonna lie, I don't, I don't do that. Like, right. anything <laughs> can be more honesty, a vibe. Though, that's the thing. It's not enough that's people being say, forthcoming with how they people feel. People don't Absolutely. want the truth. That's yeah, people thing. don't want the truth. People don't want the truth because then you look like people do. I feel like people want the truth. They want the truth. I feel like people want the truth. They don't like it, but they want it. Just because I don't like to hear it. I feel like it's two. I want to know how to move. It's two different type of people in the world. It's people that want the truth and people that don't want the truth. Right. That's how some people don't though. It's a majority. Man, I feel like everybody deep down want it. They just don't like it all the time. Yeah, like, absolutely. You cannot like the truth, but you want somebody to you tell want you clarity. what they you like. You want to know me? how to move. If a girl was fucking with you and you really liked her and all she wanted was some money, you would want her to be like, that's all I want. Yeah. You facts. wouldn't want to be getting the run around. Even yeah. if it hurt, you still don't want the run around. Yeah. yeah. My thing is too, bro, you can't... That's why I say like with dating shit and just fucking around, you can't be trying to date the girl you fuck around with. But I mean, you can, but... Wait, 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 what? Ah, it's hard for me to explain because, like, <laughs> I'm not trying to say that as you can't. I'm just saying that uh-huh. as in, like... Nah, clear it up, Twin. Clear it up, Twin. You got it. All right, hold on. Let me, let me I'm trying to out. think of, I get, like... I get where he's going. Look, I get where he's going. You were saying as in, like, niggas going into sex... I mean, going into a relationship thinking about sex, right? And so mm-hmm. my thing is, if you're doing that, then you got to be expecting the outcome of it. But right. if you trying to go in a relationship actually fucking with the female or just trying to at least get to know them, I mean, buying shit, you don't, I'm not saying don't take a girl on a date, don't do nothing good for a girl. Mm-hmm. I'm just saying it's just boundaries. When girls get abusing, it's up to you either to go for it or not. Mm-hmm. Right. And you and can me, set that boundary, I am a though. pro advocate of don't go for that shit. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Fellas, step up. Facts. It's a lot of simp ass niggas in Atlanta, man. Yeah, man. man in the world, man. It's not it's enough. Not, it's not, not enough. It is, it's not dang. enough. It is. Uh, you just ain't run across the not enough. Jordan. It's a lot of simp oh, ass wow. niggas out here that will pay. And it's like, I'm not, I'm not saying I can't knock y'all for you. Feel it, me? Bro. I can't yeah, knock I feel you it. for I your game. Because the man that wanna spend his money is just the man that wanna spend his money. Why like why is other men policing not, nah, what I a man wanna do? Nah, I ain't gonna do that. Nigga, I'm never, why does he hey, have to be I'm never gonna <laughs> pocket watch a nigga, police a That's nigga, why none you of that. Why is he That's a why I said y'all could do that shit. Why is he a simp because he he wants to I just don't like seeing niggas getting tricked out their like position and then and then going to the internet about hoes, not shit. Of their position every day. So it's like like, can y'all just play y'all part 
And then just so everybody just be quiet. Process. Like, so let everybody, I get it, your let like, everybody just do this. Just play the game. Just play the game. Play the game. Don't, Brad, don't, don't get mad everybody at the rules. Everybody don't want to play that shit. I respect that. Don't get mad at just the rules. Just go with the flow. That's Because guess what? Yeah, if you see him getting tricked out of his position, guess what? He going to go. He is That's his life journey. He going to learn that yeah. tricking may not be for him. Fact. Or he could genuinely love that shit. And he could just work to like just Drake. have pretty <laughs> like women Drake. around him. Drake. Talking about like Drake. And that's just how it's Drizzy. BBL Drizzy. I'm just, you know. Hey, man. I respect it. I get it, though. I respect it. Because it's like, I ain't going to lie. If you got an abundance of money and you Mm -hmm. see a female you like, and I could change your life real quick, and it's a pocket change. Yeah, I probably would. It's a peacock game. You like, feel me? The yeah. peacock, you know how peacock spreads just, feathers. You want to show you what he right. got. It's a, it's a, I'm just speaking for the niggas. It's a game that's of what like, you can do and what the other person can't do. I'm right. That's all men. That's how men don't know. That's how we work. But right. well, since we're doing subjects and shit, I got a question. Like, like in your previous relationships or like anything like or even future, like is cheating like a deal breaker? Like now that we older, like <laughs> is that shit really a deal Peep breaker? Game. Peep people game. would say it's a deal breaker and go back. Is what I'm saying. Is the deal breaker. So is it real deal, a deal breaker, or it depend? <clears throat> Whose question is that for? That's for right, you. I go. I go. I was really asking you. Oh, okay, like, okay. Me, like I don't talk to these. That's what both parties. talking to you for. Real. Right. That's what both parties though. Because I don't talk to these. We all gonna give our opinion. Though. Okay. Who going first? I'll go first. I want all you right. to go first. All right. So, Chin, I'm not gonna lie. <sighs> Fuck. Mm. Yeah, you gotta be careful. You want to think on it? I'll go. You, you gotta be think real careful going? with that answer, Twin. Because I like, feel like I got the whole. Damn, I gotta bro. figure it out. Because I know, I know niggas fuck with females, and I know niggas fuck with, like, they probably really fuck with their partner. Like, it's hard to break up with a female. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's so right. it's like. Hard it's just, to break up? Yeah, like, when you so really. So you don't fuck like with her some... no more. You're cheating. No, he no, talking about just other, saying, like, other way. No, he said it's hard to break up. So we gotta we gotta explore that because he no, said it's saying, hard to break up. Look, if my girl cheat on me, that's I'm saying, saying if I love her that much, it's oh, hard okay, for that's me what to you're just saying. okay, okay. It's hard for me to just be like Fuck her. Yeah, but you're gonna be like, I ain't gonna cap. It's gonna be like I gotta get back. I gotta get like at least three bodies back. Like oh, you talking about if she doing an M. I gotta get three bodies back. If she doing an M, you're it's like, like okay, we're Nah, if she doing an M, it's over for me. What? What yeah, you talking about? Low key, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, low key, oh, so yeah, it's over. Sleep that's violation. If you sleep with someone, it's over. That's a violation. Yeah, I'm thinking about if you're that's getting violation. caught cheating, like texting. Now well, that's different. Yeah, that's, that's different. different. I can't even say it's that. Different. Sure. I'm, it's I'm not even going to cap. It's different. Like, so, it's so, levels. That's why I say it's <laughs> tricky, bro. That so we've tricky. come to an agreement socially that we kind of like have an understanding that it's levels of cheating that we accept. And yes, we and that we don't accept exactly. Not necessarily accept, bro. Nah, but like, I mean, it's right. looking it's too. It's like, it's like, I can think yeah, about it. No, I can think about like, it. Like I can think about game, it. Like, but so what you think gonna about think it? About it's it unnegotiable about the other shit. Like non negotiable. It's no, okay. no. I'm sorry. Please, uh, uh, give me a chance. I won't do it again. No, 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 no. It's nothing. GGs. After that, GGs. Time out. Three strikes out. Like intentionally out. Like out. But that ain't none of that. Don't get that coochie out. That's what he's saying. That's what I'm saying. What you feel like, Jordan? Um, I feel like in some instances, cheating should be a non-negotiable. How on any level? About taking- it just it depends, though. It really do depend. I'm not going to lie to you. It be shit going so on. Depending on the nigga, like who it is. Like, it depends on if the nigga. It depends right. on the bond. It depends on how he chooses to come back from that, mm. you know, uh, you know, disloyalty. Like, What about... Re- how many times he's done it? Can he do that same method okay, well, over and over? You know the same. Same method. You know the same. Method. You know the same. That's how people. That's how I be. Probably one time. Mm. Shame on. So fool you twice. That, so you know what I'm saying? Like, so you can't twice. let a nigga play with you twice now. Like yeah, that's twice. Just, yeah. that's just crazy. But like, what if he pull up with the G63 with hundred racks all blue and every Birkin you could think of? This is reality. This this woman, I can't be bought. I'm just being real. No, I'm not saying as in just you. I'm just saying the average woman, though. You're not average. The average woman. The average woman, you have to think. It's not being being enticed. And it's not being bought. It's just enticing. It's like having a him winning you over, him trying to go to the having a little bit more stain. But that's what I'm saying. It's security. Any woman that (laughs) takes like any woman that takes gifts or like whatever, like, I just feel like it just it boils down to that woman's values. Mm. Like, nah, I fuck with that though. If That's she, true. if she, you know what I'm saying? Like, if she can put certain stuff aside. And look into like. Because I want y'all to understand, a lot of women, 
it'd be <laughs> <laughs> say that Girl, shit. It could go. Be real. Yeah. A lot of women, and I feel like this go for men too. But just human beings in general, I feel like everybody's trying to live a life they want to live. Yeah. If mm-hmm. you have a man who y'all got a cool ass bond, y'all friends, and he just can't be loyal, but like buys you these things, and literally is a big part of the reason why your life looks the way that you want it mm-hmm. to look. Mm-hmm. Then that woman may stay with that man yeah. because. It's a Essentially, it's thing. serving yeah. what she d- deemed, you know, conducive to her situation. Like, then that's on her. You know what I'm saying? But some women, and I honestly can say it's probably a little bit of ego. Yeah. Like, who? Oh, always. Who? Always. Who you treat? Like, nah. So fucking off I, is non-negotiable, though. Like. Yeah, because I can go get that bag myself. I'm saying I can fucking go get off is non-negotiable. You said fucking off? It's non-negotiable. Like, That's non- you say fucking off, what do you mean by that? If I go hit some shit, it's non-negotiable. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Correct? yeah, 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 Nor- yeah, yeah, yeah. No matter the money on, or the matter the status, the security, none well, of that? Well, see, that's the, y'all didn't hear what the, I said the first time. She said, uh-uh. I said, depend on the nigga, depend on the bond, and depend <laughs> okay. on how you, oh, how you come saying, in. I thought after. you were saying everything else, but it, it, I'm it, just asking that part. It's hard to cut somebody off if you really I'm not going to lie, like sex, that puts a huge, huge... Yeah. Like, you have to Especially literally change man. the weather. <laughs> you, you, hold on, y'all didn't hear ho. Y'all didn't hear ho. Y'all didn't hear ho. Because we talking about the man that's married to the Beyonce. What he say? What ho say? He said, y'all can make up with a bag. I had to change the weather. Move the whole family west, but it's whatever. Like, Whoa. you got, it what just depends. He like, that man go. had to really come. He had to move mountains. He had to move mountains. If a man is not, <laughs> like, if a man is not moving mountains. You say what that means. But what does that entail, though? If a man moving mountains, what does that entail? It, it, it's, it's, it's relative to each situation. Nigga, sex demon. But <laughs> within, within your capacity, within your, yeah. within your capacity, Capacity, what you can do. How are you? How are you overextending yourself over-extending. consistently <laughs> mm-hmm. for an extended amount, for extended amount of time to show me? Right. I over want you. Mm-hmm. I choose you. I made a mistake. It's not happening again. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And Basically, you overly trim twin. Well, what if yeah. a nigga? What if a nigga come, with, come to you with trim. the conclusion? Of- and I, I want to be real with y'all. Like bags and shit. Like that's not overly tripping. Like. Nah, not like that. That's, that's so easy for a man. I think yeah. women need to assess that when a but man not has every money. Woman has yeah. that. When a man has money, yeah, she that's, may not have that. That's just what's being like, not not um. That's just being what's like, what's the word? Honestly, advertise. Not even advertise. That's just what's going right now. Like niggas, mm-hmm. niggas feel like that's that's the biggest flex to buy. A female and that's bag cool, but right. that's what I'm saying. So. Women have to peep game. You got to look beyond that shit. Like, how much look. did it really cost you to do this? How much did it cost you? Like, did that really? Like, did that really was that, that hard for you that to do? Fu- yeah, that was, was that awful at all. Did you, did you get fucked up? I want to know your heart, not your pocket. Damn, so they, y'all want a nigga to be fucked up trying to make it. Up, y'all. That's basically what it's. <laughs> you don't have to be fucked up. What fucked up in what sense? So like, like all right, fucked up like emotionally. Did, hell, no, I'm yeah. saying like he got to drain is, himself. A man has to drain himself to make it up to the woman. No. You just have to overextend yourself because nine times out of ten, women are constantly overextending themselves for men, especially men that they love, like. Mm-hmm. I've been in relationships. I I would literally work a six day week mm-hmm. and get off work, get catch a flight, go support you, right. and then come back six a.m. a Ooh. flight at five a.m. in the morning, and then go back to work. Like that's overextended. I I wanted to do it, right? You yeah. know what I'm saying? Because I fuck with you, right. right? And I did it, and I'm still making my shit go. Mm-hmm. Like because I got my own motion, right? Yeah. So. Making it work. Yeah. So it might be a little tiring, but you just can't be lazy with it. Like, it's just, All right, it's so not that hard. I got a question for everybody. This this goes for us as men and you two, Jordan, as women. Mm-hmm. Uh, so the question is, would you date a man with less money than you? And for us, would you date a woman with more money than you? Uh, who going first? Who going first? Just want to know who want to go first. Um, I'll go first. Okay. Um. Pete Yang. <laughs> I ain't gonna cap. No. 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 <laughs> no. You wouldn't. Absolutely. That's no. honest though. Yeah. That's honest. That's honest. And man. I appreciate honesty. Like, that's the greatest thing that we can do. As well, and, but honestly, but yourself. but also You gotta know your word too though. At the same time. It's not even about that. It's just about bullshit. I ain't gonna discourage no female. My fault. <laughs> <laughs> I've been there. I've done that. I'm speaking from experience. I would mm. not do that again. Was it too far away? Like, not saying like. Like was the gap like OD? Yeah. Um. Was the 
You make a point. Yeah, that is a good point. Right. Yeah, like because you like, make a point. That's what I was gonna say. Like females gotta think about that too. That's a good. Gap, that's a good thing. To think. It depends Crazy. how much the gap is for me. Like yeah, and what I do agree. you all uh, like? What do you include in dating? Like, do he has to like? Is it certain shit he has to like be paying for? Like. Yeah, like 50. Not but 50, also, 50. I just, I'm just going to also be real too, though. Like, mm. there was this podcast I listened to right. about uh, high value women. And it was like, high value women don't date broke men simply because you as a woman, you know the emotional capacity you have to yeah. fall for a man. Mm-hmm. You're not going to entertain anything that's other than what you want because you could find yourself in sticky situations. Just don't put yourself there. So like, I don't think it matters, like, to me now, in my experience, I don't think at this point it matters how much less mm. or that gap. It's yeah. just, I, I'm i looking forward. If I'm making a certain amount, which is in a way reflective of the work that I put in, my discipline, and how I manage my money, then I have to date someone who is not, who is either mm. equivalent to that or more. Okay. That's fair. That's respectful. I, I respect it though. Like that's shit. That's what she wants. Shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, that's a fact. And I feel like that's the main point. Like honesty. Yeah. They got to know yeah. what that's they the main want. thing. Everybody got their own, got their own show, preference, right? bro. Like that's mm-hmm. some real shit. But who am I next? I go next. Yeah, you yeah. go next, bro. But shit for me, like, would I date a girl like they got more money than me? Basically, right? Right. Mm-hmm. But it depends about, about like for me, it's the it's the gap, like. If she's shitting on me, then mm. no, like, yeah, like, you know what I'm saying. Like, I can't even, I can't even say shit for real. Like, yeah, you don't feel like kind of. You don't like, even feel. You don't have no control. You don't even feel like a man yeah, at like, that point. Like, really, it's like damn near you like. Damn near feel like a female. She ain't even going right, but yeah. like, should we both hooping though? Like, we both good. Yeah. Like, yeah, nah, facts. She a little up more than me. A little up, just a little. Not no crazy shit, but that, I, I think I could do it. Like just yeah. talking from right now, just at twenty two years old right now. That's how I'm talking. I like, think right I could now. fuck but older, with a I don't bitch think so. with more money than me on some cougar shit, but I couldn't date her. Yeah, yeah. on some cougar, cougar shit. Yeah, but like that's <laughs> not the same. That's not Dana bit for real. real. Yeah, that's not a lot. That's not Dana yeah. bit for real. Like but I think it also think, shit. I think yeah. it also like depends on the tax bracket that we're talking about. Yeah, that too. The gap, like you. I'm not a millionaire yet, but I feel like once I hit multi millions. Yeah, billions even. I don't. I don't think I'm gonna give a fuck either. Okay, like, okay. Cause like, let's look at <laughs> my favorite Rihanna. Rihanna <laughs> and that like, let's just be real. Like this woman's a self-made billionaire. Mm-hmm. No, nah, she is. Shot Rocky, really. you know, holding his own for sure. Mm-hmm. More than enough money to take care of bills and everything mm-hmm. else. He's he's just, just not, not touching that. He's not touching that. Yeah. But f- for her, I could understand a hundred, a thousand percent. Right. Why that's okay. Like you're up. Them as niggas are y'all. Super money rich. not a thing. Y'all would be good if y'all was just mm-hmm. living off yeah. rocky it's, it's shit. It's basically about love at this point. Yeah. Money not even a thing. Money not a thing. For it's them, about for love. Sure. Exactly. Y'all even love each other. That's, right. that's the question. But until I get there, it matters. Yeah. Touch until she going to the I meetings and you got to watch the kids though. That's you feel story. me? Like <laughs> I can see that. Because then you the stay at home dad and it look kind of feel kind of. Uh, Man, I play my role. Shit. If I'm Rocky, if I'm Rocky, I play my role. Man, he playing a hell Easy. of a role. He is. Easy work. Just don't fuck that. Yeah. Up. I don't see that nigga without the babies like this. Fact. It looks go. so good on him. Like that's what I nah, think. They love that. Yeah, that's <laughs> they what I'm love saying. That. Like I feel like they guys don't. Y'all don't value like that shit enough. Like y'all so do, don't. Y'all I got don't a question. See. I got a question. I feel it. He there. He could off. not be there. Do niggas so. with a baby turn females on? No. Right now. I often say right now. No. I know a lot of niggas that's Okay, I know I was gassing Rocky. That's because he's carrying Rihanna's ch- children. Not but even like a lot of babies, but if you got one baby or at least like one that a turn kid, on? That's probably like not, not even not a, a turn, turn on, on, but like do you it dismiss acceptable. it? Do you straight dismiss it? Oh, in my life? Yes, right now. Right now. Now, Why as the dating pool starts to, sh- you know, Shrinking. as it starts to get narrow, mm-hmm. we all got to be real at some point. But right now, that's a, it's a no for me. You're not dealing with no baby. Unless mama. a man with a child just is overly tripping. <laughs> <laughs> overly trump. Keep gang. Gotta be overly overly trump. Trump. I, yeah, I can't I can't do the kid right now, bro. I ain't yeah, the kid crazy. Kid. I ain't got kid cutty. <laughs> That's a little crazy. I ain't um, got time for that, man. Yeah, no. Hey, I got I got which one are you gonna go? Maybe next year. I ain't gonna lie. We was gonna get into ranking 
the ethnic. Yeah, groups. that's what I was gonna say. Yeah. I had that on the list. I mean, oh my gosh, we need to tell them. Love put them and when down. I say that, like I mean, like Chinese, Mexican, Jamaican. Yeah. Okay, like let's I'm go. A big back, you gotta so make I a top five. You got, too. That's, Ooh, you gotta make a top five. Okay, top five. Top five. Y'all wanna do three? I do. I'm gonna do three. Right, top Don't give them too much game, cause you feel me. Top now, three. what I'm about to say, I think, is a little like oh. it's ethnic ethnic foods, but I think to a to a degree, it's a little Americanized. Okay. Mm, wait, whoa. What you mean? Meaning, I'm like, American I'm food. saying, what food? What, what are we talking about? Like, what? I've tried authentic. Let's say Thai food, cause Thai's gonna be the top of my list. I love Thai food. Mm. Top. Like as in Thailand, Taiwan. Thailand. Yeah, Thailand. <laughs> Thailand. I never Taiwan. had that. Thai food. What type of food that Drunken is? Drunken noodles. Uh, I don't eat. Is ramen considered Thai food? I don't know. I just don't be. Ramen that type is of Asian. Shit, man. Asian. So that, that's my, that's that's that whole bubble that. over there. Bronze, yeah, you feel me? I ain't tap into that lane. See, I think females are way more explored. Like y'all go. Yeah. Y'all go eat anything. Yeah, it up. we do. Because yeah, if I'm spending food. my money, I probably go chicken. But I also went to Thailand. And Thai food I need is some good. guaranteed good shit. Yeah, that's nah, I don't want to waste my appetite. Like, <laughs> I you know, like it. Y'all just black it. But that's the thing though. When you're a foodie. You know, like you can you can look at a Thai menu and look at the ingredients and be like, this gonna hit. And Fact. true to my experience, that shit hit every time. All right. I have to try I that. Mean. So but, Thai at one, what's what's number two? Indian. Oh my God. I heard that a lot. I, I, I ain't Indian tapped either. into that either. Oh my goodness. Maybe we gotta try some food. Butter yeah. chicken. Next chicken time we might masala. come with some food. Some food. Mukbang. Food yeah. reaction. Definitely gotta do a mukbang, y'all. Be 100. This shit nasty. This shit nasty. But if it's good, <laughs> mukbang, I'm gonna That lost in the spots. sauce. I heard that was good. But that, we gonna, sure. we're not on that. Indian. So we Indian. Indian. And, and then I'm gonna be real. I think I gotta go Southern. Okay, I love food. some fried chicken. Okay, I guess. Candy yams, collard greens. I mean, I don't I was know. So my grandma's be cooking. cooking soul food? Up. I was waiting on yeah. that. But that's not really... Well, yeah, I guess... That's I a guess. culture. That's don't black. dismiss. Nah, exactly. I was that's gonna say... <laughs> yeah, that is. That's well, definitely... That's my bad. We love my bad. That that's high cholesterol. Black community, my bad. Heart disease. Yeah, I need that. I was just playing. All right, so <laughs> for me... It don't have to be. Shit, this is a crazy We use... Okay, but that's what y'all don't understand. We use probably... Indian probably got the most spices in they food than that shit just don't look good. Like that's Indian spices. Food? Cause Mexican food got spices. I it's guess too. I guess because I be seeing the fucked up reels on TikTok. Like nigga, not even TikTok, just on Instagram. Them, I gotta they be take cooking. you. The, the, I gotta the, take the, you to the curry the goat with the fucking yeah, rice. Put it right there. Bro. It's the butter chicken. So no Jamaican, no no Jamaican. Oh, I food. love Caribbean food. Oxtails. Mm. Okay, yeah, that gotta be in top three. Okay, we can take soul food out. I'm not gonna lie. We can take soul food out. Over the Indian. Yeah. Over I feel it, I feel it, I feel it, I feel it. I feel yeah. it. I gotta try some Indian food. Y'all haven't had it though. Well, mm-hmm. have y'all? Mm-hmm. Well, Indian food? Indian food. Definitely not. I feel like I tried it. Like some flatbread with some like, I don't know. Some naan. I don't know what it was, but I, I I tried it. I don't Butter think I was like yeah, Okay, maybe we'll maybe try not. some Indian food next next time, y'all. I want to get into some other food though, because I can't keep eating the same stuff. Yeah, yeah you got to. Gotta and I, honestly, food. Atlanta is one of the best places to live. Even though people don't agree. No, it is. Chicago got some amazing food. Shout out Chicago. I ain't Chicago. never been to Chicago, but I want to go. You have Shout to go to Chicago. Chicago. I got to go to Chicago. I got to go to Texas. I'm to Chicago. And I ain't trying to go by myself. <laughs> no, 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 it's really not like myself. that, though. I went with a female friend of mine. We were, what, 19, 20? Yeah, in the city. It's it was cool. just you us. In the city. city. Yeah, you go to the city. That's with the that be- most beautiful city you've ever you've what? ever seen. Say that. I got Literally, I didn't even anticipate that either because everybody was like, oh, Chicago's so dangerous. they got gorgeous women out there? <laughs> Actually, I, they do. I be I'm seeing a lot of Chicago. You know they got. Some nah, looking at them. I'm not like looking like. I that. just thought you would be like, oh, she like. Kind of if a, if a, I shit. give credit where it's due, so if a whole while Bobby, I have I'm to like, go out yeah. to Chicago to see Chicago. I, like. You know, but yeah. I just I didn't experience that in Chicago. All right, so who next with with top three food? Was it Ro? Shit, I go Jamaican Southern. Shit, Jamaican Southern. <laughs> Black ass list. <laughs> it's a real <laughs> nigga right here. Real deal. Like real. it's really hard to choose outside of some other shit. Probably Japanese, I guess. Like, bro. Yeah, Japanese, like cool. some sushi. I, I okay. I'm okay. starting to get into the sushi. I'm starting to I'm step going. my sushi game up. I like okay, fried. I can't eat it raw. Fried. I can't eat the raw sushi. I got. Oh, I gotta take you to Umi. <sighs> now we're all having a field crazy. trip to Umi. My stomach. I don't know. Like that was crazy. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. That was crazy. That was crazy. Yo, 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 that was crazy. Hey, we ain't got. We just go to like That was a little crazy. Me personally, y'all are so annoying. Why do guys? Why are y'all like this? I have to know. Let's go ahead. Put this on the table right now. I wouldn't even peep it. Let's put it on the table right now. Because I wasn't gonna peep it. 
I'm glad he was here. Why? 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 <laughs> you need you need your he brothers said, for that, though. <laughs> why though? When you, you know, said? when you know, he's talking about sushi. But what did he say though? I heard what he said. We don't have to repeat that. I'm not repeating it. If you can't repeat it, I'm not repeating it. Shit. I don't fuck with all that raw shit. Hey, <laughs> raw fish. You don't fuck with raw fish. That was crazy for sure. He said something else like that. He said, but he look, eat it. what I was going to say. <laughs> oh, no, that's crazy. Okay. Yo, right. yo, chill, chill. But look, chill. I'm going to go. Um, nah. Fuck. I'm going to um, go soul food, Jamaican, and Mexican. I'm Mexican? Ooh, Hell yeah, Mexican. Mexican. I don't know why y'all ain't saying Mexican. Mexican. Mexican's probably the bottom of my list. What? Like, I would, I'm least craving I Mexican. Like a little nacho, a little burrito. Yeah, but I'm just you least craving Mexican? it. I thought women fuck with Mexican. Yeah, I thought women fuck with Mexican. All that cheese, I'm not gonna lie, y'all can't get down with it no more. Like, it's cheese, just, yeah, it's just don't be down with it. The dairy throw you off. Yeah. Shit, Tim, me. That's your shaky. I like. Top three ethnic foods, I'll probably go number one, soul food. Off the rip. That's just like what it That's gotta staple, be. Okay. At a close second, I ain't gonna lie, I like Italian food, bro. Oh yeah. You can swag that so many ways, like ravioli, the good ravioli, but <laughs> and they the say fucking, spaghetti. Uh, uh lasagna. I love lasagna. My mama, you know about that lasagna, mom. Oh god. <laughs> I need to try that. But Italian food probably my second. And then lastly, I'd probably say Caribbean food too. Yeah. I like Caribbean food. I want to go yep, back to yep, Jamaica. Yep. Jamaica was fun. I'll go back. Yeah. You look like. What age would you say you want to like get married, have a, or have a kid or some shit like that? Like take a next step. What what age would you say? Like what age? Twenty five, twenty six. Hello, it's a manifestation right now. So hello, yeah. You feel me? Hello, hello. You hear me? Is this uh? Oh, I'm trying to see. Is this the barber that cut my son hair? Uh, bar. Is this Chris? Chris, um. I got an issue with you. Um, so I guess I took my son up there like, well, my mom, well, my sister-in-law took my son up there like two days ago and I just came back from town and I'm looking at my son's head and his hairline is fucked up like tremendously. Like it's all the way pushed back. And I'm trying to understand like, were you drunk? Yes, the fuck it was. Nigga, we got the, we got the whole picture of the whole, huh? I'm saying though, because one, I don't even have my son with me right now. So you will have to make me drive all the way back to my baby mama house to get my son, which is going to cost me gas money, nigga. So. Man, me and my baby mama not talking right now. We going through it right now, man. What My thing is, if I come up there, bro. Chris, if I come up there, Chris, I'm going to beat your ass, Chris. That's all I'm saying. I'm trying to like not take it there, Chris. You hear me? Bro, this is Big Rome. You have to know. This is Big Rome. And this is me talking to you because... Yes, nigga, you see me? I looked you dead in your face before, nigga. I dropped them all twice up there before, bro. You ain't fucked up, sh- fucked up his hairline last time. FaceTime you. I have an Android right now. You have it too many. All right, Chris. So it sounds like you're not trying to fix the result. So what I'm finna do, I'm finna be heading off uh, 285 in a minute and I'm gonna be going straight to you, your shop. So where you at right now? We can. So we, where you at right now, nigga? So if I come up there in the morning and I got this Glock 30. <laughs> Oh, so you a little snitch, bitch. <laughs> you a little snitch, bitch, huh? You a snitch, bitch, huh? You a little fat. I'm hey, hey, look. I'ma see you. I'ma see you tomorrow. Make sure, make sure you up there bright and early, nigga. Oh yeah, I'ma have that Glock on me for sure. And I'm gonna make sure I bring three other niggas with me. Nigga, I got a ski mask, nigga. It's cool, though. Okay, yeah, you a little snitch, bitch. Okay. All right, bye, little snitch, bitch. I'll see you tomorrow, snitch, bitch. Ratatouille.
<laughs> fat ass. <laughs> All right. All right. Nah. That's crazy. That nigga said, wow. nigga, the police gonna take the shots the officer. <laughs> <laughs> so that's gonna conclude the pod for today. Y'all wanna give y'all farewell. W you pod. Say to the people. How you like this episode? How you, how, you, how you feel about this it? This was pretty cool. You this think was a good come back? first episode. Yes, mm-hmm. I would definitely come back. Man, shout out to we gotta, we gotta, we gotta like get Jordan some on the more. pod, man. Shout, shout out to your Instagram and shout out to people. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta shout out to your Instagram. Okay, yeah. Shout out Jordan Janae, J O R D Y N N J A N A I. And you'll see my esthetician page in the bio. Make mm. sure y'all tap in, man. First guest. First guest on T Game, man. In. I appreciate you. Thank I appreciate you. Thank you for having me. You. Sure. Okay, first we got man. the ones up on you niggas, man. Y'all tap in. Hey. IP Game. Hey, I see the merch, man. I see what's going on. All right. I appreciate y'all. We out.